guys so we've come to Hippo Prestige in Blackburn and I'm going to show you some of the cars inside the showroom. We start off with this black Ferrari 488 GTB. This is absolutely stunning. Love the 488. I actually prefer it to the 458. I think it's a much nicer looking car. I also prefer the sound with the new turbo engine. Epic. Not an F base here. Got a lovely Guards Red Macam GTS here. And then we've got two Cayman GTSs. I think this one's a GTS. And then we've got this one here, R35 had it said, doing a few clips with it. Yeah, the spec on this one is really smart. Love these wheels. They really do the car a lot of justice. As well as this little GTS decal, really nice touch. Also inside it's got the more like bucket type seats. It's really nice, I think they're quite a rare option. And it's a manual as well. We've got this Mansory Rolls Royce Wraith here. Now I'm not too sure, I think I prefer the uh, the standard one. And we've got a standard one to the other side of this. I think this is definitely an acquired taste. The spirit of ecstasy there. Come back to the interior in a minute. Got the standard wraith there. We've got a nice white XK Dynamic R. Love this, the F Type V8 R. Really smart. And silver with the black wheels. Also, this has got the bucket seats, which definitely finish it off. A Yas Marina Blue M4 there. And here we've got this very rare Audi A1 Quattro. This is the first one of these that I've ever seen. They only made about 300, 300 or so. I've always wanted to see one of these. Just a mad looking thing. And shout out to Supercars Yorkshire if you're watching this. Oh, this one's also left on drive as well. Got a nice Range Rover Sport there, got a new 5 Series, and yeah, probably going to take a look inside a few of the cars now. Right, we're going to take a seat in the Rolls Royce Wraith. This one's the uh, Suicide Doors. This is so comfy. Nice dials. Got the um, power reserve there. Yeah, just a beautiful interior, as you expect from a Rolls Royce. I'd probably say that the Wraith is my uh, favourite Rolls Royce, either that or the Dawn. I'm kind of undecided between them. Also, I love the sunroof on this, that's a nice touch. Also, this sort of wood finish. It's quite strange, but I really like that. You got a nice touch there with the Spirit of Ecstasy on the... Uh, I think this will be iDrive because it is BMW technically. So, yeah. What a lovely car. And then we've got the uh, the Mansory one there as well, like I say. But, yeah. going to go sit in a couple of the other cars now. I'm now taking a seat inside the XK Dynamic R. I think this is the first XKR that I've sat in. I've sat in a XK cab before at uh, um, Hatfield's Drag Liverpool. But yeah. I suppose not the most modern looking interior, but it still looks really smart. I like this touch here with the R logo there. And also with these, you get the um, 
turn dial for the gears, which I've heard is quite is a bit of a gimmick, but it looks cool. And uh, also the uh, how this flashes the start start button. It's a nice touch. Also, it's got the bucket seats with a nice quilted stitching. Really smart they are. Yeah, and it's a nice place to be. It's comfortable. It's a bit cramped in like I don't know, sort of the layout of the interior, but the the sort of the centre console and the dash. But really nice place to be overall. Taking a seat inside the out A1. Taking a seat inside the A1 Quattro Sport now. As you can see, it's got the red um, dial, the rev counter. Also, you get this nice little. Um, Back here on the flat bottom steering wheel, one of 333. Also, a flat bottom steering wheel, and this is really nice. This one, also, it's left hand drive, it's quite a weird feeling. Also, like, it's difficult to sort of get used to the pedals and where they are. You sort of like, it, you feel like you're more over to the right, even though I guess technically you're not, if that makes sense. It's got the uh, both sound system, it's a six speed manual. Yeah, quite a funky little car overall. What do you think of it? Come over to Blackburn Audi now, just after looking at Hippo Prestige, and here's something I didn't expect to see today. Not one, but two new R8 V10 Spiders. Been wanting to see these, so yeah, really quite a surprise. Love the black wheels on this. Really nice colour on this. It's like a silvery type, silvery grey. But yeah, I really like the spider. Not sure I prefer it over a coupe. I'd probably say I prefer the coupe, but still a really nice car. We've got the white one here, also with the black wheels and everything. Nice little carbon side blade. Oh, this one's got red leather as well. Really nice. We've come in the M240i, controversial, uh, coming to Audi in a BMW. Got the new S5 here. New facelift S3 saloon. I love this RS5 cab, that's really smart. That looks aggressive, the black wheels as well. So black and red, uh, black and red leather interior. Got a pang blue S3 there as well, pretty standard. This looks menacing. Inside at Audi, I'll quickly show you this: the new S5 Sportback. Got the coupe over there as well, a few people are having a look at it. Quite an interesting wheel choice on this one. The pan roof as well. And we've got the third R8 Spider here. I'm not as keen on the uh, spec of this one myself. It's quite unusual with the uh, brown leather. I just think the ones that the two outside look a lot nicer than this but still. Cool S1 here. Like the decals on the back of it. That's pretty different that. Then we've got the new S4 saloon and then another one there and a 17 plate uh, S4 Avant. Not, not a fan of the wheels on this though, pretty subtle, I like the red leather though, but yeah all in all I think the new, new S4's a smart looking car. Somehow when I was filming that RS5 I didn't actually realise this was here and it's a car that I've been wanting to see a lot, the new SQ7, that looks awesome. The four qu the quad exhaust pipes. Now with the M240 starting up. Love the wheels on it as well. What a beast. 
These are sort of similar wheels to what you get on the uh, RS6 Performance, but a bit bigger. I think the 21 inch. Really nice. It's a monster. It's not really bus. Yeah. Pretty hard. Frank. Idiot. What an idiot. Fool. Oh.